So what's the difference between this network switch and this network switch? So the difference between the first switch that I showed you and this switch right behind me, besides the first one has pretty LED lights and it needs cable management, which by the way, stay tuned. We have a new Dante front of house broadcast monitor system that we're gonna be installing. So if you want more information, follow, stay tuned. But this switch behind me has a 400 watt POE power supply budget. The other switch I showed you does not have POE. Now what is POE? POE stands for power over ethernet. And so what you can do with your device is you can uh, basically send power over the ethernet cable into your device to power it. So you don't have to provide power locally at the device. So no more trying to find a power outlet or big power bricks or anything like that. Now, the cool thing is that you can still use a non POE switch and still get POE to your device. And there's this device called the POE injector. This injector simply has two power, uh, sorry, a, a single power cable as well as, what in the heck? It simply has a, has a power cable and then two RJ45s. One RJ45 going in uh, from your network switch. What then happens is power is injected into the cable and then it's sent to the device. And so if you don't wanna invest in a PoE switch, you can do it that way. I recommend investing in a PoE switch, but guess what, they cost more money. So ask yourself, do you need PoE or do you want PoE at the switch?